Hello guys and welcome, my name is Aaron Cooper, welcome back to another brand new video here today upon my channel guys. Today my friends, I thought to myself, do you know what, I've been enjoying a lot of Call of Duty World War 2 at the moment. And I thought, do you know what, there's one game I miss playing at the moment is Tom Clancy's Rainbow Six Siege. And the seat is, I really enjoy playing this game, it's something I like to play a lot of, like not long ago, which I used to play a lot of, and it was just like, do you know what, I'm enjoying it. I've been making a few videos on it. I want to make more videos on it. And I want to like show you guys my progression as I'm slowly getting better as a player at this game. Obviously, I'll leave a link down below in the description to my previous videos which I've done upon this game so far. And it's just still a learning curve to me. I still need to learn the operators, which one's my sort of operator that I'm going to like the most. A lot of you out there recommended I should use the operator. Um, I believe her name is Ash. So I'm going to have to track that operator out at some point in the near future. And obviously, it's just like adapting to this game again after playing a lot of Call of Duty World War 2. Because it's just been one of the things. I've been literally playing that game a lot. And it's just like, well, I've got a lot of other games I still need to play up on my channel and continue making videos on. So I thought, you know what? We'll put Call of Duty World War 2 aside just for a second and start playing some Siege. So it's going to be nice to be able to jump into this. So I am really am looking forward to it. I hope that each and every one of you out there are having a marvellous day today. Hopefully you're all safe and well. And as it is, um, hopefully we can get into the action soon. Just need to wait for to put me into a game. Right. Got the attackers and defenders. I've only got Sledge and Castle unlocked at the moment. And do you know what I've got for my UMP45, by the way? I've got this really cool camo. I've got like a division camo. Because I've noticed in my previous videos I've been playing mainly with no camos on my guns. And it's like, you know... I just want to spice up my guns slightly, and I thought to myself, I really am rating the um, UMP45. So, that's why we've gone for a Division camo for it. So, obviously, since I play the Division, might as well put it on the camo, right? As I'm on the weapon. Right. Here we go into the action. Right, here we go, boys. Might be a little bit rusty. I've not played this game for a little while, but... You what, mate? Italiani. You what? Italiano. What? What's this guy saying? Sei italiano. Can you guys understand what he's saying? What do you think of my camo? What do you think of my camo? Looks pretty sweet, right? English. Uh, yes, Italy. Oh, I don't think you're talking to me. Say Italiano. Obviously, we need to make sure as well we get these cameras, like the little drone things, because obviously they can use them to their advantage. So yeah, feeling a little bit rusty at the moment because I, I should have really had a warm-up game before I started like making videos on this. It's just obviously, I just thought, you know what? Screw it. We're just gonna jump straight back into the action. Hopefully, we can pick up from where we last left off before. To be fair, I'm hoping I still got it. Right. So nosy around the area. Try to find some enemies. Why? I cannot understand what that guy is saying whatsoever. Can someone translate for me? Camera, camera. Push up, push up, push up. I don't think. Hang on. The reason why I'm doing this as well, guys, looking around, is because I want to explore the area to figure out possibly every single flank route where, where they could come from. Because I really want to learn all the maps, so then I see it as I'll know where all the flank routes are, so then I can literally mm. just use them to like counter the enemies. Mm -hmm. right, okay. Seven, hey. That's one. Yo! It's another. Hoo -hoo -hoo, boys! Don't smell, don't smell. 
Yo, we nearly wiped out the whole team. Got like one more left. <laughs> We've nearly wiped the whole team on myself. Watch out, bro. You might get killed. If you go out there, they will detect where you are. Uh, I don't know where the last guy is. Oh, no, my team getting killed. My team getting killed. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Uh, right. Avanti. Where is he? Left. Okay. Right, right. Yo! No! Oh no 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 no! Fuck! Where is he? Where is he? Yo! Careful, 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 careful! Come on, Aaron, play smart, mm. play smart. If we kill this guy, we would have wiped the whole team. Sway for him! Come on! Come on, bro! Come out! I'm not gonna lie, guys, this is really intense right now. It's like we're in a 1v1 situation. And Aaron Cooper's had like lack of sleep. I'm not long gone from work, you know what I'm saying? I'm not ready for this yet, bros. I'm not ready for it. We should be alright. Where is he? Come on, make a mess up. Yo! Bro! Where the hell is he? Yo, yo, yo. Found him, found him, found him. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes, mate! We just wiped the whole team! Good old trusty teabag. Just for the victory. We literally wiped the team there. I don't think any of my team members got any other kills. I think that's like literally my first ace on this game. I believe that's what it's called. It's an ace if you wipe the whole team on your own. Fair play, though. <laughs> but I didn't need a warm-up game. It looks like I've still got it, boys. Right. It's time for me to sledge my way in there. Castle, I believe, is a pretty good operator. Like, I I generally am, like, digging that particular, like, operator. I think it's pretty cool. Um, sledge, I've used quite a few times. I do like... How Sledge is as a character. Like, I do want to start trying to get some kills with his hammer, though, because I've heard that you can literally one hit people with his hammer and the dead, like, literally. So I wouldn't mind getting a few kills with that soon. Um, but for the other operators in the game, I do want to generally, like, unlock them all and do videos on them all just to showcase to you guys what these operators are like and hopefully learn their abilities and become really good with them. But obviously Ooh. that's going to be a learning curve for you, so it's going to take, you know, it's going to take a bit of time. And obviously, I do want to put a lot of time into this game when I'm not playing Call of Duty and stuff. So, um. we'll see it is. it's something that we can do to go around the channel. If you do have any tips or anything for me regarding Rainbow Six Siege, maybe you're a, a player that plays this all the time. Um, any tips or strategies or anything that you would like to share with me, then please drop them down below in the comment section. Like, I, I, it would help me to get better as a player. So I wouldn't say I'm a great player at this game. I'd say, like, I'm an average player. I feel like I'm alright. I'm not noob. I'm just above noob, if you know what I'm saying. It's just one of them. Alright, sledge my way in. Alright, go on, bro. You go up. I'm gonna go... Let's push in now. Let's take it nice and easy. Try not to make too much noise. Wow, the enemy's been detected outside. Yeah. And he's been <laughs> dropped. <laughs> hang on, hang on. One thing I've learned as well with this game, play with the headset because it helps so much. You can hear the footsteps and everything. <laughs> nice. Seriously, I thought I killed that person. That was mad. I thought I killed that person. Yo. Fair play, though. The, the, I think they did get him in the head, though, to be fair. Fair play. But, yeah, I see it is, though. We did go for a nice little good run on the first round there, but... It's a shame that we did die, though, guys. I'm 4-1 right now. 
I'm doing better than my whole team. I think I'm doing better than mo well majority of players in the lobby. To be fair, I think the second person on there, like who's got the sort of like upper hand, is on their team. They've got like three kills. Fair play. That was pretty cool, right? So I'll turn to and dive back into the action. All right, four kills, one death. All right, we're getting castle again for this one. Or should we go recruit castle? Let's do this, boys. Mm. Hopefully we can um, do better in this round. To be fair though, I was quite surprised that that person did kill me. I literally thought I did kill the person, but it's one of them things. These things happen. Right, I'm going to barricade you guys in there. You can stay in there. Stay in that room and you can make love to each other. As for me, I'm going to explore. I'm a lone wolf. I don't play this game with my team. I play on my own. Going in solo, boys. Do you guys want to come join me? What are you doing, bro? Right, you've been spotted. Where have I been spotted from? Yo, oh, I'm thinking I could chop your thing on the ceiling. Like, barricade the ceiling. I don't think I can do it. Oh, that's poo. Right. Guys, you need to figure out what you're doing. Stupid camera. Well, stupid drone, I should say. I'm gonna have a look for these guys. Yo. Nice. It's one down already. I shouldn't really be doing this sort of thing, but I don't want to be staying with my team because I feel like if they raid that room and they manage to kill multiple of my team members, they're going to kill a whole squad, but if we all separate out, or if I separate out, and they're up there, I can kind of use them as bait. just want to keep a close eye out, because I have a feeling some of them may be down here still. I know some will go for the upper floor. Yo, bro, can you be quiet, please? I'm trying to do commentary. Bro. Let's try and find these enemies. Easy. Come on. Right, let's see where that one is too. Let's do it. Ooh, ooh, ooh. They're close. They're close by. You right, bro? He was going to breach the wall through. Fair play to him, like. That would have been a sick strategy, but check me out, boys. I was teabagging. <laughs> but fair play, though. I knew what he was going to do, though. He was going to breach charge the room, and I think he was going to try to get my team by surprise, but Aaron came to the rescue. We went for a flawless victory, though. They didn't even win one round. So I managed to get my first ace, cleaving the whole team on my own, and we went flawless, and I became MVP. I can't really complain about that, guys. That's three yeses. That is just like spot on. In my eyes, a good little run through for a newbie noob at this game. But hopefully you all enjoyed the video. If you did, then give this video a thumbs up and subscribe. I would really, really appreciate it. Um, if you want to see more Tom Clancy's Rainbow Six Siege, then simply let me know. Drop some comments down below in the comment section. I would happily go out the way and make some more videos on this game. Um, I do want to put more time into the game when I get the chance to, guys. And stuff, so obviously, with loads of cool G content and stuff to do and other games and stuff. I see it as it's, you know, it's obviously something I can do with you guys when I get the chance to. Anyways, have a marvelous day, and I'll see you again next time upon another brand new video. Take care, and hope you all have a great day.